There's this growing interest in new ways, new tools that churches can use to reach people, reach into their community. And so Facebook ads is one of those huge new areas and more and more churches are trying it out. Facebook ads, Alex, are in my opinion, the absolute best platform for outreach for your church, yeah. marketing for your church, yeah. whatever word that you care to use when it comes to reaching the people beyond the four walls of your church into the community, people who are unaware of you, people who are aware but aren't yet connected. The currency of the world is attention. So in order to get new visitors, what we have to do is we have to go where people's attention is, right? And right now, that's Facebook. There's no bigger platform than Facebook. 2.2 billion people on Facebook, 1.5 billion log in every single day, and the average time spent per visit is 20 minutes. That means if someone who's within driving distance of your church is checking Facebook three or four times a day, they're on there for an hour to an hour and a half. If you are not using Facebook advertising, you need to be. It is very inexpensive for the impact you can have. What makes Facebook ads so amazing is first, it is underpriced mm -hmm. compared to a billboard, compared to traditional media ads like radio and television. It is drastically affordable, as you'll see even for smaller churches, which yeah. is amazing. Digital has given every church kind of an even playing ground. And I wanna reach people in my community. The people that drive up and down these streets, the people that walk by my park, the people that are near my facility, I want to reach them. If we don't adjust to the reality of the situation, then we could become irrelevant or even worse, extinct. We have to learn how to, how to, how to successfully navigate the shift to social media. The good, the awesomeness, the community, all the great benefits of being a member of our church, how do we, how do we put that stuff forward? How do we let people know? How do we let our churches get in our ministries get discovered online the opportunity that we have as churches especially smaller churches like like myself with facebook ads right now it's unmatched i think it's unprecedented i don't think we've had an opportunity like this ever before so i'm pumped up to talk about facebook ads. okay if i understated it allow me to overstate it it is the single greatest outreach platform <laughs> yes. in human history yeah. why number one I believe that, actually. <laughs> Number one, the attention. Mm -hmm. The amount of people on Facebook in your community. Seven out of every ten American adults active on Facebook. It's called Facebook ads for the local church. It's how you can reach people in your community. How you can reach out to those young families that are using uh, social media on a, a daily, if not hourly, basis. You can get in front of 5,000 to 10,000 people. You can radically reach out to the world with your message through Facebook advertising. But the powerful aspect of Facebook ads is you really can reach into your community and reach new people uh, for your church and for the kingdom. This is how can we come alongside churches and church leaders and say, here's how you use this tool. You, over the next few months, you can turn campaigns on and start reaching new people, visitors coming to your church every single week. That's our hope and that's our prayer that ultimately you would then see more life change in your church than ever before. The ads are very simple to make, very simple to create, and it turn you into a visiting uh, a guest machine. In other words, folks will start coming because they'll see the things that you have. Reach some very young families of your own in your community. And if you can practice this in your ministry, you'll be able to make a huge impact in this world. A st recent statistics say that 71% of online adults are on Facebook. So it's just an incredible place to potentially reach out to new movers who of course are such a great group of people uh, that will be looking for a church. Their attention is on Facebook. That's why we have to be there. One of the things that you can do in order to, uh, to successfully navigate that is use Facebook ads to invite people to your church. I'm telling you, the results are insane because you can literally create a video on your iPhone, inviting people to church, upload it to Facebook, and literally within hours, start getting people to go to your website and sign up to plan their visit, right? But to see a steady stream of first time visitors visiting your church. Hey there, it's Dan Ermler from churchhero.com and Ryan Wakefield from Church Marketing University. Hi there, this is Mike at reachkeep.com. Hey, what's up? Sean here, co-founder of Think International and creator of YouTube for Churches. What's up, guys? My name is Chris Abbott. I'm your host, Alex Mills, joined as always by the boss man, it's Brady Shearer. And today we're talking about how to run Facebook ads for your church. What's going on, everybody? Corey Gray here. And right now we're about to talk about how to advertise for your church, for your ministry on Facebook. 